baby, baby, and Bobby Boo. <laughs> beautiful pe- <laughs> hello beautiful people welcome back to hella jam i'm so excited to take you guys thrifting for halloween at savers you are og hella jam followers you guys know that this is like a dream partnership this is huge so I used to go to Savers back in the day when I was a kid with my dad, thrifting ever since I was a kid. Long story short, Savers is where I first really started my Hella Jam career, thrifting and sharing my thrift hauls. So thank you so much Savers for sponsoring this video. It feels like a full circle moment. Um, thank you so much for my girl Viv for sharing the contact. Uh, community is everything and I'm just so, so fortunate. So if you guys don't follow her, definitely give her a follow here. Um, so I actually shot this on my vlogging camera when I was editing it. There's no sound, um, but I'm going to do a cute voiceover. So let's just have fun. Cool. Let's go. As you can tell, this is me so excited to go into Savers. Just feeling very grateful. Like this is me and my dad's friend at Savers and he was so pumped for us to work together because he knows I have a YouTube channel and he knows that I've been like asking him like, hey, do you know anyone at Savers headquarters that I could reach out to? So yeah, it was a really, really cool moment. For anyone who doesn't want to like thrift an entire costume, Savers already has costumes that you don't have to use any creativity and just like wear like a Spider-Man costume, whatever it may be. But they do have a ton of accessories and wigs. So if you just want to use something from your closet, just go to Savers and get some of the accessories and you have an instant costume. So I was supposed to go in uh, knowing what I wanted and I tried to go in with an open mind. That didn't work because I got overwhelmed. But I do know that I want to be Ash for when I'm trick-or-treating with the kids from Pokemon. And I know that my son would freak out. And of course, I found that hat. How perfect is it? So I posted on IG different looks of what I would want to be for Halloween. Like, you know, there are girls that dress risque and that time has passed for me. So I'm most confident in oversized clothes. And then I shared this photo of Betty Boop and y'all lost it. And we're like, go for it, do it, do it, do it. And so because y'all told me to do it, I am going to hunt for a dress so I can be Betty Boop this Halloween. Overwhelmed because of course I wanted to throw it for myself, but then I found this dress and I thought, hmm, maybe I can dye it red and that would be perfect. This is a perfect dress for Betty Poop. Boop, not poop. <laughs> oh goodness, get ready. And then I found this one, I was like, wait, this is definitely more my vibe because it's just like a grandma, it's cute. Also, this is really, really cute. Vintage sequins. Perfect. Do I have an occasion to wear it? Absolutely not. And then I found this blue vest, which is gonna be perfect for the Ash costume. I lost my mind. Like, look at me. Look at these stuff in my eyes. And then I saw this and I was like, oh my gosh, I really need that. I don't know why I always dress like a senior, senior, senior person, a senior citizen, a, a Filipino grandma. Like I love like textures anything loose look at that it's gorgeous beating like get out of here this is me telling myself do not get distracted stay on task but then i found this two-piece 90s pinstripe suit and i had to get it scotch and soda in great condition i can't even talk right now i'm just so excited I'm so bummed I left this, but I, I have so many coats. Like my coat rack is literally going to fall apart, but I would wear it. Okay, now for Halloween decor. Do not skimp out on home decor. I know that when you're thrifting, it can be really overwhelming and not gonna lie, when I first went in there, I was so excited. I just lost my mind. I usually go to home decor whenever I'm thrifting first to kind of like ease myself into it and to get inspired. Cause I like going into thrift stores with an open mind and once I went to the home decor section, I was just so excited to decorate for Halloween, thinking about how can I DIY some of these things. Originally, I wanted to get some of these dolls and put it on a wreath. And then I realized I could really, really scar my kids, so I chose not to. But also look at this marble bookend. Insane. That you can get that for such a cheap price. It's proper marble. Definitely needed to get that. I just figured I could add that to little trinkets. The bippity boppity boo 
so cute. I know that my daughter would just love it. It's just so kitschy and fun. Then I was looking for ping pong balls because I want to add googly eyes and sure enough, I found it. Do not ever skip that section. I, it, I often overlook that section. Oh, this is my OOTD of what I'm wearing when I'm thrifting. I thrifted this sweater, so much fun. Reminds me of the Grinch. I'm wearing a leotard because they don't have a changing room and that way I can just change in front of anyone, everyone. Um, but look at this Ash costume, so wild. I was thinking if I cut the top of this top, it would look pretty cute. I don't know about you guys, but am I the only one that geeks out and loves talking to other people at the thrift store, especially the employees? Like as I was going through and checking out, I was like showing them everything. Okay, now time to decorate for Halloween. So I wanted to add a little bit of like DIY action and so I just wanted to add some fun little squiggles. I wanted to elevate it a little bit, but then add a cute little like DIY touch to it. So that's what we did. And then of course I had to add some tooth gems to my vampire teeth. So can you get some spiders and some fangs and put them in the web? Ooh, nice ring. Nice. Good job, soul. <laughs> now it's time to get ready to be Betty Boo. I looked at up a ton of tutorials and on how to like finger wave or curl my hair to get it to look like that. And what I did is I just used a mousse and then I curled, created little curls and then added these little pins and just hoped for the best. <laughs> Literally just hoped for the best. And then one came out and look at it. It worked perfectly. It was so, so, so cute. I just cannot believe that I actually did a decent job. Also, these clips are so much fun. I don't know who needs to hear this, but this is your reminder that when you are getting ready for Halloween, just have fun. You don't have to look like everyone on Pinterest. Like, add your own creativity. We're not aiming for perfection, just have fun. When I was doing my makeup, I did a little bit of research on like what to do. And then I realized, okay, well, I'm not a makeup artist, but let's just listen to your instinct and just go for it. And I'm really, really happy with the outcome. I actually enjoyed getting ready for this look and putting the look together. It was just a simple red dress that I th obviously thrifted at Savers and then it was just all makeup and hair. And I'm really, really impressed with the makeup. Like, look at this, are you kidding me? I actually did a decent job. I don't think she wore gloves, but I thought it'd be really, really fun. Like, why not add gloves for the drama? Like, look at that. Hand model, drama, oh yeah, really feeling myself. Put the dress on and like, I just, I honestly didn't even wanna take these clips off. I just thought that it was so much fun. Okay, put, put the gloves down, Jamie. Okay, now it's time to remove these clips. Let's go, let's see it. Oh my goodness. I think I did a decent job, guys. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. I am shook. I'm so sad that the like, you can't hear my reaction because I'm surprised that I was able to pull this off. So do so you see guys, it's not it's not perfect. Like I have a gray hair that's like poking out because you know, aging is beautiful. And my alopecia spots are showing and that's okay. That's normal too. But I'm just so, so pumped with how this turned out. And I hope this just inspires you to just have fun this Halloween and don't get discouraged by what you see on Pinterest. I'm so, so mind blown by all of this. <laughs> Freaking out. You're actually pretty lucky that you don't hear me screaming because I'd probably like break your speaker. So I decided to just add little, little bobby pins to hold the curls around my head that look like little horns and that's it. <laughs> I love this. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you haven't yet, subscribe and click that notification bell so you get notified every time I post a video. I'm coming back. I'm so excited. This is my first video back on YouTube. It's a thrift haul with savers. I hope you guys liked the costume. Let me know in the comments. Cool. All right, peace.
one of my friends say, girl, you better take care. Cause that man is trouble, you better.